What's going on guys, Blake Melbourne here, Uncut Kitchen. Today we're gonna to take off the double whopper from Hungry Jack's. And all my other people from outside of Australia, yes, we call Burger King Hungry Jack's. I don't know why, we're just Aussie and we're fuckheads. Let's go get some Hungry Jack's, man. I think it just sounded a bit more Aussie, but yes, this is our Burger King here, all right? So, I haven't even opened this yet. Let's have a look at it. Oh, okay, yep. They're not really showing off, are they? Fucking hell, God. So, there's a bit fucking all over the joint. A little bit of wilted lettuce, a little bit of sauce, some thick tomatoes, some pickles on there. Mmm. I think we can make ours a bit better. But I'll have to give it to Hungry Jack's. Their burgers are better than Macca's. It just tastes better wrong, and it always has! At least you get full after them, but look at these little patties, too. Like, Try it out as fuck, Patty. So we'll do our best to make ours better, all right? All right, so we've got our ingredients here. First thing we're gonna do is the patties, right? So I've got 500 grams of beef mince, all right? It's a four out of five star, okay? So not completely lean and not completely just fucking fat cunt, all right? What that in between. So a bit of salt and a bit of pepper. Bit of black pepper in there. We just want to mix that up. And then we'll make our patties. Now usually, if you're gonna do patties like this, I'll usually do like smash patties. Just pull, put it into a ball and then beat it down real thin. But I want to make some nice, not crazy thick, but thin, but just enough to cover our burger bun as well. Make it look pretty. All right, so I'll just put some water down on my cutting board and some baking paper and just a little bit of oil where I'm gonna do it, just to make life easier. So, this ball there. Bam! Now, like I said, I don't want it too thick. So I'm just gonna push it out. That thickness is looking all right. Not too thin, not too thick. Now, this is my bun here, and this is bigger. So I want to use that. If you use something the same size, it'll shrink and be smaller than the bun. Let's see how that is. It fucking close. And down and twist. Voila, there's our patty. So do that twice, because they're doing the double whopper, and then we'll get it on the pan. All right, so pan on. We've done our two patties. And we'll chuck these boys on. Oh, have a look at them. They're good. Alrighty. Let's go flip some burger patties, eh? Oh, look at those beautiful things. A little bit of salt. So, while that's cooking over there, just mid-temperature, we'll do our little fillings, get them ready, right? So, I've just got a little bit of lettuce here. Just chop it up nice and easy. Spin the head. And just like that. And that fucking wilted shit. So we'll make our sauce too. Hungry Jack's, fucking Burger King, they literally put a standard mayonnaise on that. We ain't going to do that. So, mayonnaise. Two large tablespoons of that, all right. Garlic, you can use garlic paste if you want. Just one in. A little bit of white pepper. Just a touch. Now, I've got some, some brine from my beautiful pickles I got here. I just want to add a little bit of that. Yeah, teaspoon. I've also got some fresh dill as well. You can just throw it in actually like that, but we'll just break it up a bit. You don't have to do this, you can just use a normal mayo, but we're gonna fucking turbocharge this burger marmite a bit fucking more special on our time. Shit, bro! Just mix. A pinch of salt. Oh yeah, that's good. That can go in the fridge. Nice little flip. Lovely. Looking good. Looking good. So our other toppings that we have, so we've got our pickle, we've got our tomato, we've got our onion, lettuce, and our American cheese. You have to have that, all right? Patties are looking good. So they squeezed in, but they squeezed in too much and they actually got thicker. Classic cooking made, eh? Shit happens. I'm gonna clean down that pan, wipe it down with some paper towel, chuck our butter on, and start toasting. Buns on, push and absorb, push and absorb. 
Mm, wait for that big dog, and we've got a whopper coming out. I don't cut my tomatoes until it's ready to put on the burger. Heat off. Beautiful. Don't burn yourself, mate. <laughs> Aren't we? Alrighty, let's build this hoe. Paddy, close enough, Blakey, close enough. Yeah, cheese on there. There's a bit of heat coming off this guy, so it should melt pretty well. Go down. That other patty that for some reason shrunk even more. Oh well. Right. Then more cheese. Something like that. Now, some tomato sauce. And pickles. I'm just laying it exactly how they do it. This is what they do, and this is what they're going to get. Three picks. Some onion. And tomato. Tomato. Beautiful. Now, our sauce out of the fridge. Alrighty. Uncut kitchen mayo, not just some standard. Get the good shit going. Lovely. And boom. Hey, it's smelling like fucking hungries. Look at that, eh? That looks a bit prettier, doesn't it? And yes, yeah, so I one of those patties a little bit thinner. I didn't want it that high, but squish it down, mate. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Well, here they are. Fucking hell, eh? Here's my big dog, and here's the double whopper. A little bit of difference. Just a touch. <laughs> they smell the exact same. I'm not even joking. So, I'm gonna get mine down a little bit like this. Oh, look at the juiciness. Oh, yeah, mate. So, there you have it, guys. Uncut Kitchens, double whopper. Hunger Jacks, Burger King, double whopper. You can do it at home. Fucking easy as. I'm gonna cut some off because I'll feed the boys and see what the difference is here. <laughs> okay. Hey! I'll tell you what, it's not far off. It just, this, it just tastes a bit fresher. So, stay tuned for the next episode. Cause I'm gonna cut some more bits off this, cut that one up as well, blindfold the boys, and see what they reckon too. The honesty, the truth, let's find out. I'll see you guys next app.